Strom the Horror. Neil here playing his second game and not having my fucking stream shit up. <laughs> Pro streamer, dude. Don't mind me. I was about to do something. I totally forgot what the fuck I was gonna do. <laughs> oh no. Oh, face cam. There it is. Ah! Uh, down. Type enough. Somewhat. Tis good enough. Tis good enough. I have the industry. I say that's up to you if you want to you stream or not. Completely up to you. Because I'm about to be on this for a while, really. Because I'm really hoping this is good because the first one was actually like a lot of fun. All right. For those of you guys who are joining us from YouTube, how all my adventure is doing, we are going to be playing the second Remother. So we played the first one. That was like a long time ago, like way back when. And I kind of enjoy that. I'm kind of hoping two is going to be better is at least what I'm hoping. So let's go ahead and oh, you can recap. Hell yeah, go for it. Recap it. Where do you want me to start? From the beginning. The story so far. One late afternoon, a mysterious woman who introduces herself as Dr. Reed Rosemary visits the villa of the old notary, Richard Felton whom suffers from a strange disease. He is assisted by his personal nurse, Gloria Ashman. Oh, I forgot about After her. After a brief and fruitless conversation, Reed is exposed as an imposter. She has come to the villa to find out what really happened to Felton's missing adopted daughter, Appreciate Celeste. Those. After being thrown out and refusing to give up, I forgot Reed to mute hides those. until nightfall and sneaks back into the villa to search for clues. As Reed explores the villa, she soon finds herself in the center of her worst nightmare. Richard Felton has killed his wife, Ariana Gallo, and has lost his sanity. Oh yeah, that man was the running around with his cheeks out. I forgot about that. <laughs> Felton and a mysterious red nun begin hunting Reed. Reed eventually reaches the attic, where a mysterious girl who claims to be called Jennifer is found looming in the shadows. Reed eventually discovers that Richard Felton and the Jennifer in the attic are actually the same person. Richard Felton was born as a woman, but was then forced by her cruel father to live as a man. Phenoxyl, a drug created by Felton, the Ashmans and Professor Wyman on the Rosagallo farms, was created from a rare breed of parasitic moths to repress and erase traumatic memories. It is revealed that the drug was tested on Felton and the nuns of the nearby convent. The drug caused terrible side effects, hallucinations, severe light sensitivity, and homicidal rage. As Reed was escaping Jennifer, Gloria returns to the villa and offers to help Reed. So yeah. Gloria drugs Reed, and upon wakening, she finds Gloria forcing Felton to cut out his own tongue and burn himself to death. Gloria reveals that she is the Red Nun, the sole survivor of the fire at the convent, which was started to cover up the Phenoxyl experiments. Gloria had been hypnotizing Felton for revenge. Wait a minute. Okay, After I'm starting to piece the ending back together Reed again. Manages to escape Gloria's murder. Did she break rage. her <laughs> I totally Just forgot about Gloria that shit. Passes, she reveals that Celeste is still alive and that she had fled the Felton Villa years ago. Reed must continue her search for unanswered questions. If Gloria was the daughter of Felton's associates, the Ashmans, why was she used as a guinea pig for experiments in the convent? Who were the Feltons protecting their daughter from? What happened to Celeste Felton? Oh, will we learn that today? Maybe. Wow. 
So, hello? Okay, I'm back. There we go. <laughs> Is the enemy close? Run and hide in a wardrobe. Okay, well, thanks for uh, just throwing that, uh, that whole hint right past me before I can read the rest of it. I appreciate it. Hi, uh, folks, would you? I suffer from that every day. <laughs> All three side effects. Yeah, no. I wouldn't even use that shit. What the fuck? Man, do we got a weapon in our hand? The fuck? Did she just drop the weapon also? Excuse me? Can't erase memories oh, there forever. it is. It would be like erasing time itself. Memories and time go hand in hand. The consequences would be even more devastating than Alzheimer's disease. There would be no separation between pre and post trauma. The memories would wander autonomously in search for answers or a common okay. ground. Fractured by spells of amnesia, hallucinations, and emotional swings, two opposing <laughs> perceptions would coexist, overlapping and threatening one another to the detriment of the one truth now shattered, the so-called porcelain memory. Huh? My light, what the fuck? I have stamina, no. They're coming. Um, excuse me? <laughs> yeah, there's an achievement called Strike. Okay, cool. Good to know. I don't think that does anything. And plus, I am losing stamina. And my control is actually vibrating. I forgot that I had my controller. I kind of figured you were supposed to die because there was no exit. You couldn't escape him first off because your stamina is garbanzo. Remothered. Save the game. This game has auto save. No. Your enemy is so close. Your best bet is to run. Okay, thank you. Like I could just read all those really fast, you know. <laughs> you know suggesting that all this time, these people kept these experiments synthesizing this parasite, the moths, that were carried out on the nuns at the plantation a secret, making them intentionally ill as if they were lab rats, just for. This drug? The phenoxyl. The farm, the moths. The hypnosis. And all those deep and dark family secrets. Family secrets are very dangerous. The most dangerous of any kind. The only way to survive was burying them so far down inside ourselves. And to move on. Richard Felton. Ariana Gallo. Professor Wyman, the Ashman sons, Stefano and Gloria Ashman, Stop. they all made a choice. And so did I. So you chose to forget. For 49 years, I left a part of me behind at that time. I did everything they asked of me. Forget. But one day, that missing puzzle piece resurfaced. Like dirt stuck beneath your fingernails it is there and always has been 
Sometimes it is a song, a lullaby, or a certain item. But for me, that missing puzzle piece was a special person. A lonely one. Just like me. Feels bad, mate. Can't get no dick no more. All right, so where the fuck are we starting is the real question. I'm pretty sure our character has been murdered or kidnapped. <laughs> okay. Mr. Ashman. Andrea. The girl is here. Shall I let her in? I was about to say, that man act like he just got caught with his pants down watching some porn. <laughs> Go on. Sit down. You know why you're here, young lady, don't you? Oh, did you just throw me into the fucking... That's a perfect point of view just to throw me in. I am willing to turn a blind eye to the money and the cigarettes. Don't be fooled into thinking that I don't know about them. But for everything else, I refuse to do so. This is not a tourist resort, nor a playground. Breaking an entry? Larceny! What plans did you have for that God damn it, gun? I hate games like God this sake, Jennifer, that has like, tell me. just... All the details everywhere. It's kind of just like no, don't need cam at that point. It seems you are a magnet for trouble. From what I'm reading, you cause a lot of hassle, especially at the Flemington Girls Institute. Other huh? girls similar to you ended up straight in juvie. Did you know that? All I can do is apologize. I can assure you I never intended. Young lady, what are you running away from? You are safe here. You can talk to me about it. I'm serious. No. <sighs> Very well. We will have to talk about this again. Considering what has happened, I have made arrangements to give you new chores. You will help Eliza in the kitchen. But, sir! You will do your best. I've always done my best here! I seriously doubt that. Damn. When and this is why I don't want to talk to you, you about shit. Wish and as you see fit. But until then, you are under my care and you will do as I say. Run along now. What a fucking asshole. Oh, and by the way, Lindsay will no longer be a problem for you. What do you mean? She insisted that I send you elsewhere. Instead, Damn. I have organized to have her transferred to another facility. They will be coming to collect her next week. You may leave. Down there, you talk about she thick, she thick. The what the fuck? Two twelve has to be cleaned. Oh, and don't forget that you'll be helping Elisa in the kitchen after lunch. Okay. You've really done it this time. Make sure that the two of you don't get him agitated after his parents' death. Mr. Ashman Jr. did everything by himself here. What happened to them? Dead, my dear. Like all those who grow old. And I'm sure the mourning sped up the process. Mourning? For the nearby convent. Have you seriously not heard of it? The convent just went up in flames one day. Even this building was partly damaged. A Dude, dozen nuns doors. died in that fire. Mr. Ashman's sister, Gloria, being one of them. That's terrible. They had contracted some sort of disease. They practically went blind. They had gone mad. And that Dr. Wyman? Sure as hell didn't help them. Oh, you trying to ruin your fucking she stomach. That's what I hear. By her own parents. Why? Hi, Jen. Oh, Andrea. 
I'll start with room 213. Okay. Did Mr. Ashman have something to do with it? Shh! Lower your voice! You'll get us thrown out of here. It seems that Mr. Ashman had the bad habit of touching his little sister. Oh, God. Oh, wow. Duh, okay, oh, excuse me? The parents didn't like this at all. So they sent him to a family relative in the north and his sister Gloria to the convent. If it were me, I would have done the opposite. For him, the arrangement only lasted a few months. For her instead? Well, that's another story entirely. He had always been mommy and daddy, sweetheart. Pretty fucking cringe, bro. Make the most out of things. Get buying items to get more powerful tools. Oh god, of course. Fucking course. <laughs> I just picked up an item and it's gone. Oh, okay. Cool. Good talk, though. I appreciate you. <laughs> the hotel will reopen in late spring. Until then, I will only see the same ugly old faces. Enjoy a romantic getaway located at the base of the mountain. Around. Where breathing takes the view. Oh, where breathtaking views are coming. Okay. Oh, no, there's collectibles. Cool. I'm not doing that. Don't you know? TV? TV. Okay. <laughs> Nothing else on the TV. You guys can see everything, right? I got a moth key. Excuse I can't me. I'm still dragging around this lice-infested suitcase. I've had it Everybody can hear everything perfectly. about over here? Oh, I have a knife. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. Hey, that's the same dude that beat my ass. Calvin, you scared me. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Ever heard of knocking? No way. But it's still last year. Everything okay with Ashman? Of course. Fantastic. Never better. Everything is great. He got angry, didn't he? Why would you care, Lynn? Tell me. I was just asking asking what it's none of your business Damn. what are you talking about you can't be upset with me forever i'm trying not to be but my arm keeps reminding me <laughs> i didn't mean to it was only an accident do you have any idea how guilty i feel Jen, please i feel so shit about it I didn't want it to get to this point. I already know it all. Ashman told me everything. What are you talking about? You suggested to him that I be transferred elsewhere. Is that what you wanted? You're really a bitch sometimes. A bitch who let herself be fooled. But no, in the end, you withdrew yourself. You didn't Damn. want to get in trouble. I didn't want to get in trouble. Well said. You think they would have gotten away with it, right? Go away, Lynn. Leave me alone. No! 
You're you're going to let me speak. Go away! Then please open the fucking door. Dude, what the f <laughs> I thought we knew each other, but I was wrong. Go away. I beg you. Yeah. Ah, oh, shit. Huh? Dude, I don't fuck with this satanic bullshit that's going on, excuse me. Help! <laughs> Stranger danger. Please. Oh my god, Jen, you look like hell today. Okay, you didn't have to say that. My feelings. My own feelings. I thought the dude was coming in. I got another moth key. What the fuck are these moth keys for? Hello? Oh, damn. She got kidnapped. There's nothing we can do about that one, Chief. There's a letter there. What does it mean? If this is a joke, I don't like it at all, Lynn. What is she supposed to be down here? Oh god. Fun. Anything else over here? I have another knife. Eliza said she would have taken care of it. I don't understand why it's locked. Okay, so what the fuck's going on now? Locked? This door has never been locked before. You're just going around locking doors now? What the fuck? Ma'am, can I please have you unlock that door? It's time to eat. The fuck? Who is that tree for? Who are you talking to? Let's go see. That should get snatched up, you know what I'm saying? I don't understand. There aren't any guests at the hotel. Who could have ordered a meal? What the hell does Acarontian mean? <laughs> oh no. What the fuck? What the hell did they do to you? It's like, that's micro, bitch. <laughs> Once upon a time, <laughs> what? It's part of all of us. We are all part of the same thing. Help! <laughs> Help! They mustn't find me. Oh shit, I remember this. I gotta keep it in the fucking Dude, well, that shit is way harder than it used to be now. I won't open my mouth. I'll keep everything to myself. That shit's a lot harder to do now than the first one.
Did she just call me a fucking slut? Rude! I heard somebody unlock a door. First, I have subtitles on it. They didn't even show anything up for that. Did she go by? I don't think she did. Then that means she went back to the other side and opened that door that was over there. Wait for my stamina to come up. This, yeah, this stamina is gonna probably piss me off. <laughs> So I can't look at my inventory oh, while I'm in here. Oh, Where have I ended up? Okay, so I guess with that note, I'm out of here. She's no longer searching. Uh, I do want to also make it be noted that, uh, <laughs> yeah, that the game does not pull when crafting. What the fuck is she doing? Ma'am. While they were wandering around the house, I am here working my ass off. Ma'am. Okay. Wanna talk about our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ? Stealth. Be sure not to be heard. Even by Oh, even when looking at something else, stalkers can notice you by the sound. Walking, crocking. <laughs> walking, crocking. Where the fuck did that come from? Crouching and walking. Make sure to not be heard. Sometimes stalkers won't be alone. Be aware. Everything can. Oh, okay. Okay, I thought it would show like some short videos or something. Uh, where's the crafting one? Crafting. Andrea, what the hell is going on with you? This is you shut so the so fuck up. Ugh, I have a migraine, and it's all their fault. Talking no. You want to look this way first for me? Ma'am. Okay. Good talk, though. Good talk. No, I know those feels. That's locked. Nothing I can grab. Okay, cool. Just gonna go ahead and sneak all along. What's in here? This must be the hotel's older wing. The one which was engulfed and destroyed by the fire. Oh, I see. Um, where the fuck are we going? <laughs> okay, washroom. Washroom. Getting PTSD from the beginning of the game. Washroom. <laughs> okay, I was wondering if I could pick up multiple things. I cannot. Did Andrea really suspect that someone was poisoning her? But, but who? This is in the air and the food. They are poisoning me. Oh, well then. Feels bad, mate. <laughs> Nothing I can do about that one. Stupid bitch, why'd you scream? What happened? What? It's Andrea. Fuck, fuck. What the hell is 
going on with you, Andrea? I, I must warn the others. Okay. So am I watching this? Oh. <laughs> That's the most weirdest fucking washing machine I could ever see in my life. Okay, yes. He said it can go up just a little bit more. I'll say, oh shit. Alright, I'm gonna raise it at least to right here. What you got in here? It's the key for the padlock. Oh, so I'm going down. Huh? No, no, look. You want to play hide and seek? No, not really. I didn't fucking ask for it. Bitch, did you just lock the door? I'll cut you. Crap. She locked the door. I'm trapped. Okay, let's see. Cuz I know it's going to be really annoying again. Cuz it makes no sense. Why is this one like so much harder than the first game to keep it in the center? Like, it's kind of like jerking the shit out of it. Yeah, you're fighting this damn thing. Like, holy shit. <laughs> Bye, ma'am. Please don't lock the door on the way out. My God, I have to leave this place at once. You'll be an asshole if you lock that on the way out, just saying. Um, no, not that. There's a lot of weapons in here, though, at least. And would you like to talk about our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ? Because I think you need him in your life and whatever God you're worshiping, I don't approve of. So I'm going around the other way. Am I supposed to have a map or something? <laughs> Apparently not. I don't like these red lights. Wait, which one did I come out of? This one, right? Okay, then I came out of that one. I'm going this way. That's locked. So what achievement now I have? Use a telephone in the lounge. Call for help. Find a way to open room 213. Unlock and use the lounge for okay. So base is just the same thing. Just go to the fucking lounge. <laughs> Ma'am. God damn it. This is You guys have a fucking cinema room? Dude, let me fucking know if there's some cinema bullshit going on there. 
Wait, are you telling me I gotta go all the way back around? Oh yeah, because there's a downstairs through there. I want you wanna bet she's just chilling out there too. All right, crazy lady, I'm going downstairs, okay? Have fun. Yeah, here it is. Let me guess, I'm gonna shock the shit out of myself once I do this. What the fuck? Did I repair it? Okay, no, I'm supposed to repair it. Okay, cool. Good to know. How the fuck am I supposed to repair that? Do I need a screwdriver? Uh, okay. No, fair enough. There's rope. How the fuck is there rope? I was just wondering is do I need probably not the smartest thing for a screwdriver, but you know, hey, he may be maybe emerge it. Nope. Okay, just fuck me, right? All right, fair enough. All right, dude, I'm out of here. Just gonna find a way to fix everything. Leave all the serial soul searchiness things for me. Ma'am. I'd like to talk to you about our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ if you're still near. And there she is going back to her work. I love you, buddy. I'm gonna just walk through here, okay? You have a fantastic day, all right? Love you. You're awesome. <laughs> all right, all right. Damn, her footsteps are fucking loud. You have boots on? Take that shit off. What the fuck? <laughs> I just realized that. The fuck do you have boots on? For survival, I would have took that shit off. is the only one to have keys to all the locked rooms. Okay. We have to find so. a way to get her to open this door. Oh. So, oh no, do I have to let her chase me? Is that what's going on here? I have to let her chase me. Of course. Of course, you know. Oh wait. Cause she'll come through this door if I put this right here. I swear to God, if she walked all the way around. Hey, bitch, you have keys. <gasps> My doll! What the fuck, bruh? <laughs> yeah, no, we're just gonna pretend like you don't have fucking keys. Alright, fair enough. <laughs> I mean, just like... Why not, you know? You just don't got keys out here. <laughs> the fuck? Shut the fuck up, all right? Not like she walked over and beat your ass or anything. Not yet. We will soon. <laughs> like you act like you couldn't open that door with your fucking keys, you dick. 
How dare you? I do have an idea, though. Just to see if she leaves the keys. I could throw an item halfway across and just have her go over there. Yay. Okay, wow. So she just instantly sees you too. Thanks for the keys, bitch. Goodbye. Okay, so you can't use that item. The item's not usable. So the rope is basically useless when you think about it. It's kind of like, wait, what's the point of the rope? <laughs> Am I? Oh, okay, I see, I see. The rope is used for locking the door. That's basically what it is. Hi. Dead by daylight juke. Dead by daylight juke. How are you? Okay. <laughs> I think there is. No, there isn't. Wow, there's that's a lack of hiding spots. Dead by daylight juke. Wait, what was that icon? That icon did nothing. I was like, I thought I was supposed to click it or something. No, it did nothing. So I guess it's a time thing. And when you're already clicking, it already already confirms it. Fair enough, I guess. So even around the corner, her radius of seeing is like huge. So she was at the door. I thought she was literally didn't have the vision to see me as soon as she came around a corner no they made her vision like all the fucking way around like a full cone or full circle in front of her you want to play hide and seek wow they put you back right here what a shitty save i've been hurt i have to hide they're coming crap she locked that's the a trash save point So you have to progress the story in order to have the auto save. Girls, filthy. If you make no progress, your story doesn't save. That's gonna be annoying. Bye, ma'am. Yeah, you'll see how far that gets you. It's only a bad dream. Did I drop anything? Ah, it's a side. Okay, then. Anything else? No, this. Not that. This. This. This item here. This. This. I. Oh my god. The item in front of you. Thank you. <laughs> Literally the iron wire. That I thought everybody could see. Including you. This knife. Okay, so every direction is locked. Andrea is the only one who has the key, which I'm pretty sure 
means we have to stealth up on her bitch ass and take it. If that doesn't work, we're going back to the fucking locker again. And that's back this way, right? Because I think this was just like the hallway. So since, she, since she's the only one with the keys to all the lock rooms type shit. It's kind of like, I got to get her to open it. It's like, no, no. It's, <laughs> she, her AI is not like going to be doing that shit, apparently. You could throw something and she'll go right back to her work. Like, just fuck it. Oh, the mirror. Okay. Okay. There we go. We have saved. Cool. Nice. Now I don't have to go back to the fucking shittiest start point. Let's just try it. Fuck it. Ashman, but we didn't need desperate children. They're coming. What are you doing here? Nothing. Okay, character, can you like <laughs> get the fuck up and run? Thank you. I mean, it's not like she's gonna try and open anything. That's the thing. I, will make you I don't think this AI is incapable is actually capable of like opening things though. Oh god, stuck, stuck. <laughs> We tried the tricker. I don't think that's gonna work with that though. Enough with the hiding. Wait, did she just lose me already? Okay. No, oh, she actually came in. The fuck? You're just gonna sit over there in the fucking corner. There must be a way. <laughs> so once she starts talking, it's pretty much you're safe. She stopped looking for you. So how the fuck do you get her to open shit? Because we tried a distraction. I guess we have to have it way closer. Hold on. Okay, we have a talking baby. I said I can get that moth key by the baby. Let's see. Oh, wow. I didn't even see that shit right there. Uh, so you can get hooked on things like very easily too. Like if you're running a certain direction, you can literally get caught on anything. Damn, it's locked. You, it doesn't have like a... Oh, okay. Well, fuck it. It works. The only one who actually gets any work done around here is me. So, uh. Okay, so s I see. One, two, one, three. 
The only one who actually gets any work done around here is me. Hello? Okay, hold on. This is supposed to be a hotel. This room number is followed by number three. By floor. Girls. Filthy girls. Filthy girls. Okay, then. <laughs> Have I not been putting that in? This is supposed to be a hotel. It feels more like an orphanage. Okay, I'm I'm reading this wrong or something. Follow these instructions. While they're wandering around the house. Oh, I wait. This is here working my ass off. What now? Okay. To make sure not to get caught. Oh god, I hope they don't find out. I'm so tired of all this. I just want to come in from room 213. Who's wasting my time? Yeah. Wandering yeah. around the house. See shit. Yo, see shit. Okay, we're good. We're fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I'm so tired of all this. But I'd say, what the fuck? That's a lounge? Are you kidding me? That room's a lounge. Like, I'm supposed to know that that's the fucking lounge? I don't have a map. Elisa? Where did everybody go? Access the balcony. There's no power. It won't work. Okay, so I got another high spot. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Hold on. No hiding spot in the restroom. Got it. Locked. Are you kidding me? I will break that shit. You shouldn't have encouraged Lynn to take part in the contest. And maybe I wouldn't have almost lost an arm. What was going through your head, Lynn? The top of the world, what the fuck? Ah. Oh. Just to make sure she doesn't just walk all the way over here just from that one tiny sound that she's like five years fucking away from. I'm patient. I can, I can wait. Okay, I was about to say. Young lady. Are you fucking kidding me? She did! Oh my god, I was joking! She actually fucking did hear it! 
She's ten years fucking away. Come on. Come to mommy. <laughs> oh, all right. All right. So this is what type of game we're playing. The fucking sound horror of a century. <laughs> yeah, she played Call of Duty for sure. <laughs> Hold on, bro. All right. Oh. She played Call of Duty for sure. She heard that shit from all the way, like, four or five doors down. <laughs> uh, give me her ears. God damn. Like, I just... I literally threw a bottle at this fucking door. This bitch is like... <sighs> all the way down this hallway in this room working with a loud ass fucking sewing machine and she heard it excuse me i have a lot of fucking questions about that shit All right, bruh. So I need two one two open. Now I've already been to two one two actually, so I don't have to worry about that. This one I can get into. One three. So all the rooms in here are accessible. Except for that. Now that's too fucking bad, loser. Yeah, you came back to a fucking Call of Duty grandma. You sound horrid the shit out of all that. Oh, here it is. If I, uh,. Actually, Hill is going to break the mirror, if I remember correctly, from the first game. So I'm going to try no hit <laughs> and just save, you know, just save, just save. Mephistopheles. I always hated it. It's all their fault. Hey. I'm going to need you to go to a different room now. Right, one so actually gets any work done around here. two one one me. So I need floor and room. What the fuck floor am I on? Actually, excuse me. This is the lounge. So this it's must be fault. one or is it zero? It's it says zero one, so zero two. Hey, huh? let's let's type in. I told Ashman that we didn't two, need desperate children. Three, seven, number. No. Fair enough. While they're wandering around the house. Okay, so it changed from working my ass off from that number to something else. It's something else. Three seven. Let's go with. It would be best if I just told him to don't work with one, crybabies. One. No. Okay. Fair enough. I tried. <laughs> I can't be ass. Fuck it. Ma'am, I need a map, please. Please, where's the map? Wait, how would you how would you get away from her if you 
did call it? That, that's the real question. Oh, okay. I would have to lure her away from it, then go back, call it as fast as possible, then get out of there. Psh, fucking wish. Okay, yeah, this is this is two one one. So why didn't that one ring? Oh, because I need the floor number two, I think. No, because this is the same floor, right? Or am I drunk? Am I okay? I have no idea. I think I'm losing my mind. No, this is the same floor. The f the fuck? Okay, so that doesn't work like that. Noted. 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 All right. All right. Let's try it again. Okay, so we got the only one who actually gets any work done around here is me. We got two one three working. Two one one number. No, so it's number two one. Girls. Filthy girls. Nope. That one didn't work. Two. One. The only one who actually gets any work done around here is me. We get it. You're gonna bitch and complain. Okay, so there's no more numbers we can use for now. This is supposed to be a hotel, but it feels more like an orphanage. So there's something in 2113 that we're missing. It would be best if I just told her. Either that or I haven't found the other objectives that I need. Since everything else is scratched out. Then I guess we're not going to be able to do that. Unless I was to like brute force the shit out of it. Call. Okay. 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 Six, two, one, three, one. 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 All right. All right. All right. All right. Six, two, one, three, one. I'm going to forget that, <laughs> knowing my shitty ass memory. Six, two, one, three, one. I'm so Six, tired of all this. I just want to break from two, it Two, one, three, one. In order to factory reset your safe, insert the following code. Three. Ah, uh, okay, hold on, hold on. Wandering around the house. I am here. Do I have a fucking journal? Now that I think about it, I, I don't remember them telling me about a journal. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I've been collecting all this shit, but I have not been able to access it, right? Yeah, I haven't been able to access any of my uh, stuff, so I have to actually remember all of it. Okay. I see. I, like, I got the number in my head. It's just the model number that I have to also fucking remember, too. So, great, you know? <laughs> All right, the model number, okay, is one, seven, six, number. Okay, one, seven, six, number. I, I'm, I can remember that. Sure. All right, we got it. We got it. We got it. Don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, 
Dude, I've seen better days. I've been fucked up, bruh. It would be best if I just told him I don't work with crybabies. I get it. Then tell him. God damn it. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Three. One. In order to factory reset your save, insert the following code. One. Three. Oh. Two. One. Four. Oh, wait, hold on. Excuse me? So I have to actually follow that code. Hopefully they asked me the model number. I just went back for no fucking reason. <laughs> It's all their so, fault. Hey, uh, one, three, one. In order to factory reset your save, insert the following code. Three, two, one. I told four. Ashman that we didn't need desperate children. Am I done? Help, <laughs> please. Okay, okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. We got this, we got this. Please tell me the safe is restarted. What is in this shit? It better be worth it. Wait. Can I not open this? It's because by it is because the power is out, I think. Fuck, how do you open how do you fix the power? It, all it does is shock me every time I touch it, <laughs> which is well deserved, you know. Dude, I'm grabbing this off the fucking wall. If it doesn't have any ammo, it's just antique. I'm whacking her upside the head with it. So I can't do anything with that. Oh, I found the bottle. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. So electric power is down here. Power box. Oh, okay. So this, that goal wasn't activated. What's this? Okay, so I can't do anything with that. Got the screwdriver. Okay, so we gotta figure out how to fix the power. So I guess there's something missing. Where the f ah, okay, apparently I'm supposed to have mechanic skills too. That they just threw me out here without. <laughs> oh. Because uh I'm trying to remember. I think she heard me. Oh yeah, she heard me and I was trying to like move, but I got stuck on like the side. Fuck it, let's heal. Well, nah, I don't need to heal. Like I said, I could just uh, try no, no more hits. Just save it for when I actually need it. I've tried. It it didn't work. <laughs> let's just say that. Wait. Okay, nothing. The only annoying thing is. Okay, it's exactly like this, like the second game. No, open that. To where I can't tell what's a uh, actual serious item and what's not. It's a letter in there. Nine? That's something I need? 
Maybe, maybe. I'm just leaving fucking items everywhere. That's basically what it is at this point. Wait. Okay. Screwdriver wire. So I can craft that into a more powerful item. Wait a minute. I hope so. Because <laughs> I ain't picking that shit up. Oh, another moth key. What the fuck's up with all these? Why, excuse me? Oh, so I got skills out here now? Oh, it's from the moth keys. That explains what the fuck the moth keys were. That's exactly what I was asking. Okay. Mini game against stalkers trying to break through your door becomes slightly easier. Oh, is that the only skill I have? Because, oh, okay, there we go. Shadow reduces noise. Okay, so first off, what we're going to do, take a step back, because I just wasted points on that when wasn't when I wasn't trying to. Because <laughs> my mouse wouldn't show up for some reason. I was looking for my cursor and I was just like, huh, that's kind of weird my cursor isn't popping up right now. It's over here in a fucking corner again. <laughs> But I, that's something the first game didn't have, from what I know. Fucking skill tree now. But HP recovery when stealth, well, when crouch? Or is that stamina recovery? Let's go back and see. Yo, wait a minute. Is it quiet for anybody else? Oh, because my fucking headset went down. I was sitting here like, wait a minute, I can't hear anything. Okay, so I can get another one when doing that. Increase the range and reduce the highlight items after Moth Eye. What the fuck is Moth Eye? Stamina would be the best thing, really. Sprint duration. Uh, it's either between this and this. I'm going to take one for here. I'm definitely fake taking fucking stamina. My eyes. I, I appreciate you blinding me, bro. I, I didn't need to fucking see anyway. <laughs> thanks, thanks for that. I also wanted to be known that I haven't healed yet. From the mirror. 
So that's pretty clutch. And we also know where another key is. And that's in front of her desk. We gotta lure her away. Okay, I just saved. I'm gonna send her back to that room again. I am here working my ass off. Think now. I have to make sure not to get caught. Oh god, I hope they don't find out. Get the key, get the key. There, just got it. Why are you doing this? Wait, what? She can s she can see that? Go in. Hi. You not? Get up. I'm fucking out of here, boy. I'm fast as fuck. Bye, lady. Let her hear that. And I'm gonna go in here. Wait, that shit actually works? I can just slam over a door and just walk. Oh, oh, no. Nope. I will smash you in pieces with my own hands. I swear. Ma'am. Nobody's over there. Ma'am. Hello, you good? No, hi. Can you fucking not, mate? Mate, mate, fuck off, mate. I'm Go away. <laughs> Holy <One>. shit. <laughs> Two, two and a half. Oh, you're just gonna two and a half it. <laughs> Your bitch ass definitely didn't know where I was, so that's why you two and a half did it. <laughs> why me? Why? Oh, you still gonna end up in the restroom? I say crystals be destroying. <laughs> okay, so I got ten. I'm waiting for another one. Get that uh sprint speed. So I can be fucking Sonic out here, you know. That milk. Oh, missing. What the fuck is that? Oh, that's just a box. Oh, crap. Fucking missing person, bro. Okay, 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 okay. Her sprint burst is like actually huge versus versus this enemy at least. Yeah, you have to keep your fucking the cursor in the middle or she's going to open it. That's basically what it is. If you successfully do it, then she just walks away. Wait, is there anything over here? Oh, that's just another box. Oh, hell no. Pick that back up. Because that is actually like... We can use that multiple times. Where is that the right one? Excuse me? I don't know. Or maybe I didn't craft it because I went back, right? I mean, you got to think of it as like the survival element of it.
It's kind of like instead of them just, you know, blindly walking past it. They sort of give you something to fight against. And if you fucking, if you fuck up, you basically get entered into a chase, basically. Wait, did she actually clean that shit up? Hold on a second. Oh, my moth key. Hold up. Hold up. Next, next skill. Yo, I'm going to be searching everywhere for these fucking keys now. Great. <laughs> fucking key hunt out here. Sprint, sprint. Oh, they gave me 20. What the fuck? 10% stamina. Yeah, I get blinded again. Fantastic. Always enjoy that, you know? That means I gotta check everything. If I leave anything, like, unchecked, I'm screwing myself over for not having keys. Any skill points. Which I like because they force you to like look around. You know, you just can't stay in one place or, you, or you're not going to progress anything. Yeah, knocking over your face. Marquis just standing over you. <laughs> okay, so we have that. <sighs> okay. So let's think here. We have to fix this. We have to also access the balcony. We got to repair the electric cables and turn on the power. Oh, here's the collectible shit. There it is. I hate you all just for that. <laughs> And cereals. I wish I had a fucking map. <laughs> you guys don't have maps out here in this fucking establishment? To be honest, I can send her. Damn. Can't make external calls. I need to other hotel rooms. Okay, so let's see. Like, 211 is where I want her to open up. But it doesn't open. It would be best if I just told him I don't work with crybabies. Okay, so <sighs> that's annoying actually, because I need her to open that. Girls. Well, I can girls. send her to 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 like. 213 again and look around a little bit more. Oh, I screwed that up. The only one who actually gets any work done around here is me. Another key. Book. Scissors. Scissors. I want to see what happens if I do this. Just for fun. <laughs> girls. Filthy girls. Hi. How you doing? Tis of me. I'm out of here. <laughs> Too bad. I'm faster than you. Are you going to shortcut cut it? Oh, dude. She's speaking bars. I don't want that. I'm out of here. You said this is fucking something witchcrafty. <laughs> 
At this point, I'm just fucking with the AI. I need to stop. <laughs> okay, so cables, cables. Where else would I find cables? Maybe I should check my uh, first room. Because we we've unlocked 13. Room 213 is officially unlocked. We don't have to worry about that anymore. Uh, we don't have to, like... I don't think we have to mess with her anymore, actually. She's still down there? My character hasn't saved jack shit. Normally she starts speaking whenever she stops chasing. I have to stay calm. Okay, there we go. Okay, let's check our room again. Because maybe we missed something in our room. Oh, I have a safe too, but I can't open it. Because it's already open. <laughs> okay, then. Damn, dude, I'm packing fucking knives, heat, and everything. The hotel will reopen in late spring. Until then, I will only see the same ugly old faces. Have they completed their chores? Obviously not. And nothing in there. Is there anything in my fireplace? Is the next question I got. Nope. I can't believe I'm still dragging around this lice infested suitcase. I've had it since I was at the Flemington Institute. The funny thing is all your audio recycles whenever you reload the game. So this is the hiding spot too. Okay. Can I get out on the balcony on mine though? No, I cannot. You can't get out on your own balcony, ma'am. Your own balcony, you can't get out? You good? I said, I know she has the keys for everything, but goddamn. Is that a shovel? <laughs> That's a shovel. <laughs> huh? Eliza? Wait, I thought we were already in here. There's no power. It won't work. I thought we did this already. <gasps> Another key, another key, another key. Did I just grab that cup through that glass? Damn, it's locked. I shouldn't have encouraged Lynn to take part in the contest. Okay, so things have Test. reset Maybe I have from when I last saved. What was going through your head, Lynn? Bottle. There's any items in here that can help. There's rope. <laughs> I can think of several different things to use for rope. <laughs> and it's not good at all. <laughs> ah! The fuck? Oh my god. That means she's gonna come up here now. Great, you screaming Nancy. Now she's going to sound whore the shit out of that. Come running all in the room. I'm going to sit here and chill. Because I know it's going to fucking happen. Is she seriously not going to come in here after that? But she comes in here after the fucking cup getting thrown against the wall? Flynn, where are you? Oh, okay. So she was coming here, but she lost aggro. 
Oh my god, the bitch was coming here. I'm pissed, dude. Okay, yeah. Just the smallest things, and she's aggroed. <gasps> the electric cables! Fucking out of here, mate. I'm heading out of here. I'm dipping. Oh yeah, she's gonna be she's gonna be very pissed that I turn on these fucking lights. While they're wandering around the house. I mean you don't have to be working. It's not like I'm fucking telling you to. Okay, we've made progress, okay? It's progress. It's how I like to think about that. Bruh, I already- hold up, let me go fucking save, because I already know some bullshit's about to happen. They're about to fuck me over. Damn. Bro, I'ma honestly need you to take off those goddamn boots, bro. Fucking high heel boots- eh, eh, eh. Yeah. That's the smartest thing to just have on during these situations. Bro, I'm going around barefoot as stealth as fuck. I'm gonna get popped, aren't I? Yes, yes, please. Oh no, I almost had it. Okay, so I have to tap the shit out of that. Yes, yes, please. Yes, I did it. It'd be weird if an AI didn't find it suspicious that the lights came back on. Nah, that's just all natural to you? Alright, fair enough. Bro, well, that just means these lights are just gonna pop more often. <laughs> that's all I'm sure that's going to be, is that these lights are just going to pop way more often just because I turned that shit on. And she's just, she's just going to scream at every fucking thing. <laughs> 